James O'Keefe is the founder and muckwrecker of Project Veritas. Yep. Project Veritas, I believe, started about 10 years mm. ago, maybe even longer. I do remember when I was still drinking back in the day. I had some martinis with uh, James over there at the Copper Door and before they boycotted free staters uh, anyway so um so he's a you know he he he's a controversial figure love him or hate him uh where he sort of became famous as he did the acorn yes. thing back in the day so they they tend to do sort of guerrilla style or undercover or investigative reporting uh costumes the whole thing the thing that made people mad about the acorn thing so this was basically a dude who dressed up as what you would call a proverbial pimp like there was no doubt i mean like big right. coat hat a uh, cane i mean it was ridiculous it was like okay how could you not see this as satire <laughs> but apparently no one did um so so that's sort of where he cut his teeth his new book is muckraker yeah. and am i saying that right i think i, I think am. so muckraker Muck, maybe muckraker sound i don't know raker maybe with m-u-c-k-r-a-k-e-r -K. um you say it however you want uh but basically it's his new book and he talks about all these lawsuits so he came yeah. and and i really like the way he framed it so basically i guess he did a class with dartmouth yeah maybe with the journalism students, and then he did this open to the public talk. He was expecting, and I, actually, honestly, I was expecting, like, you know, maybe some pushback, right. maybe some people who are protesting. It was all awfully civilized, which tells me maybe we're moving beyond the sort of hysteria, the get the mob of. out for dumb ideas thing, and we're, we're ready to go, oh, maybe we need to debate these ideas. Yeah. Uh, so he um, he did his talk on the the article that was published in the Dartmouth newspaper okay. by the former editor of the Dartmouth newspaper, and uh, this guy basically wrote an opinion piece, but where he was presenting facts that weren't facts; they were actually opinions. Mm -hmm. So he sort of dissected this article as a way to say, hey, let's look at this. What is the role of the press yep. and the media? Is its job just to offer opinions, which is kind of where we are now? And that's fine. Everyone's entitled to an opinion. But then you have to tell me, this is your opinion. My opinion is James O'Keefe is an award-winning uh, writer or a liar, whatever your opinion is. But if you're going to call him a liar and you can't prove it, then that is not a newspaper article, Correct. right?